Sports Unlimited. Brought to you by Kasapreko Alumu Bites. Established in 1960 and receiving its first inmate on October 10 of the same year, the Insawa Medium Security Prison has over the years housed persons with varying degree of offences. Located on the southeastern part of the Insawam Township in the eastern region of Ghana, its establishment was necessitated by overcrowding in the then central prisons. This is the Insawam Prison, a major correctional facility for convicted persons of varying degrees of offence in Ghana. We have come here today to establish the house sports and particularly football, is used as a major tool for recreation, rehabilitation and reformation. Often a reference point in discussions about reformation, authorities here have been doing more than talk to ensure rehabilitation happens for most, if not all. In comes sport, a tool used as a rallying point to see to an effective and successful implementation of a key part of a reform program that has people at its very heart. The category of inmates here ranges from those on remand to condemned. While some have entirely given up and confined to misery and regret, others are willing to live their lives to the fullest. Football came to the rescue. TV3, thank you. Since I was born, I used to uh, say that when I grow up, I will play football. I was once a defender, so my goalkeeper, my, uh, some of my teammates, some of my teammates used to call me John Boy, John Boy. Where, where were you playing football? At Teshin. Oh, okay. So, which were some of your teammates? Uh, I played with people like Boaji, Daniela Mate, uh, Lord of Sweeney. My father used to support me. All of a sudden, Back, that's why. But um, things happen, you're here now, but nothing has changed. You're still playing football, you're still happy. How has the experience here been? Oh, very nice. We used to say that everything that comes to the Almighty God. So when I'm here, I focus on the foot pitch. When I, I wake up, I come to the training. How, how has that shaped maybe your mentality as a footballer? It's very, very hard, but I, 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 will, I, will cope, I will cope. Life here can be extremely excruciating mentally. By the minute, the inmates here deal with thoughts of being left out on good behavior. Kinsley Amankwa, also known as Schneider, tells me exercise like this go a long way to help them to stay sane. It's a great opportunity for us, even, let me say, physically. It is good for you to exercise. And this entertainment takes part of our worries from the sentence that we are serving. So I think it is good for us. How does it take your mind off? I think in so many ways, because they, when you are in the block or in your cells doing nothing, at times you feel dull and it lets you think a lot. So as we take part in this kind of football activities, I think some part it takes away our worries. It sets our mind free. So clearly, then it helps your rehabi rehabilitation, yeah, rehabilitation and pro process? Both mentally and physically. I think it's good for us. And also, it's a way for others to, to exhibit their talent. Because some of them, they have the talent, but they don't know how to think, exhibit it out for others to see. And we have good coaches here who are taking us through training for us to, I think, do good in the 
for sports activities. It's very serious because we don't have a lot of MC entertainment or things to work out or to enjoy ourselves. So we take this opportunity. I think when we are playing football, all the blocks, everybody, including the officers, everybody comes to make sure everything goes on well. So I think it's good for the prison service. The reassurances of not giving up on one's self is a difficult daily sport for most here. The imagery that continuously play out in their minds speaks loud tones of remorse and becoming better. Has it made you a better person? Okay, I think so. I think so. Because you mingle with different kind of characters. Because without the football, you may be in the cell, MC on your own, doing nothing. But when you come onto the pitch, you meet different people in different blocks. And I think you mingle together to uh, have fun together. So I think. Do, do you plan playing football when you leave here? Okay, only God knows the future. I can't determine my future. But I'm hoping if I go out earlier by the grace of God, uh, I'll make it. Are you going to make things better when you leave here? In some part, I regret, but in some part, too, I think it's a lesson for me because when I was outside, there are things that I used to do that when I came here, I've come to realize that in some ways I have to change my character, I think it's very necessary. And it got me close, sad to God too, because when I was outside, I didn't get a time to let me see, even read the Bible, though I've been going to church at times. But coming here, I got to know what to do at the right time, and I got to know how to respect each and every one, no matter the age difference or the situation. So I think the prison in some way helps some of us, but the problem is how long we stay here. I think that's the main problem because some of us, by the grace of God, we've changed and we are hoping God will make a way for us so that we step outside there to be with our family. Most of the inmates who take part in this exercise played amateur and professional football before fate landed them here. While they rule the chance of not being able to freely do that which they love, the opportunity to continue their dreams still lingers. Derek Tete, popularly known as John Boy, is one. Like, when it's outside, you, you, like, you get enough time to train. But this, uh, this place, everything is time. So I, I can't get any, like, much, much time to train, that's why. This is the first year I, was, I, I used to play. But I'm playing to God, and maybe this season or next season, if God permits, I'll be out. And when you get out here, do you still want to still, play football? For sure. I'll play. Inshallah, I'll play. Who do you look up to? Hmm. Which footballer do you look up to? My mentor is Clifford Abouaji. Very skillful and talented player. Schemer, very, very schemer. That's all. What, what about Clifford, apart from him being skillful, what about him that motivate you for he, you to know you can still play football. He's very, very quiet and he's very, very respectful. That's why. Before going out of this place, if there's one lesson that you've learned out of here, maybe through football or any other means, what would that be? When I go out, I've learned a lot here. Very, very lot. Even outside, I don't, I don't know, like, I know here, but I haven't come here before. But when I came here, I've known that when you did this, it's offense, when you did this, so when I go out, I will never do that again. Okay, but so you're, you're motivated to become, in, in the next maybe five years or so, you see yourself as being a top footballer for Ghana? Yeah, for sure. I'm praying for God Almighty, where I will do. Hmm. For sure, I'll do it. I promised my father that I'll do it. So, anywhere he is now, I'll do it for him. You promised your father yeah. that you'll be a big football star? Yeah, yeah. And you're still going to hold on to that? Inshallah. Talents are bound here at the Insawan Medium Security Prison. Despite the stereotype persons here face, a lot continue to make the most out of their lives. Lives some did not bargain for.
So behind me is the football pitch hosting the Champion of Champions Cup a finale to end the league that is organized by the prison's service. All these players are inmates and take part in this competitively. For these players, despite being cut off from the outside world, football provides an escape from the psychological weight upon their shoulders. These games have brought out real superstars who keep honing their fine skills and have become good at it, such as goalkeeper Ahin Abwaji, whose heroics on this day was worth noting. School time. Oh, I am a kid. 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 my life is yes, time, man. I saw this so bem kakra. Tama born so men tama bo anko echi men stop point mi dejuma. Ne shi ana saw this ana ndebe nya case. Na man ba. Okay, into uba ha no send it ya shapei o o life say say. Eh, me ka se me ba ha na bo ame. Me bi abo me bi so amo ame. Se na mo abo nti na nye. Na nye. Se me yenyo ma me anka se me ba nu se na nyo ma me yenyo en fata eh ni gana mla no eh en fa ba na mbi se me ana mbi me hunti na me ba me hunu se me ba ha na abo me bere eh me hunu se ya me yenyo na nyen ti me me ne se ya ha me kwa bonti me hwe na na mu tu mi ye from abonti ni ha ni football no se se na we see experience ni te se eh me ka se experience no me ka se me ba ha na ma me hunu se mi obi bi o mi mu I meet my in future. I have no sort of policy in Kakra. I'm a Bahano. I'm a Fabono, and I'm a Quadro. I'm a training in your man. I'm a hope you say, born on a head, meet my born in future. I'm a Bahano, so I'm a policy. I'm a more experience. Five saves. I think five or more than five. Five. Five saves. Who make it five saves and then we'll champion of champions win. Usi usi fa yani sey because en kofo gana for the be answer penalty if you if we usi yani sey. Eno ya dia mi training e won ho de bia sey pon training kwa no a me 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 kisha sey me di meet in ba ku be jina na de be wa tra me panetic na ha ma che no sey no ya dia me me ni wo sopa sey de me sey ho eno so ka ona ne mi timi e bom ho modern. Ete omo omo ba be bono now 
o study o man asa wey dey na otimi etimi chebon me chebon eh na ma show mo nine no eh ade ade bia me training o ho eh me training o timi nim the me am so me civil eh na nem dbt o okay but o say bia nya me wadom na so timi free ana o ko abon ten so a o hope say o beto a o bo bo ne so eh me to aso me to aso o say na me bi da shim mu say eno na me eh me say me person me come back to then I'm in your man, I'm here or back. No, I'm better me collecting me huna. Me too born so. I say me whom me whom me say me or young. Me me share any sir. Then I subit me too aswa ebe bo ame. I me 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 carry ane. What how many years? More twenty nine. Okay. And uh, goalkeeper Ben na o o share ne ni ama isi ano. Ghana ha na say abuche goalkeeper Ben ne biya wa share unkwa o o share ne ni ama isi ano. Me kan. O na na. Or Cameroon, Cameroon Gipa, or Nana, and on a national movement in the pair. Till the machine will make you as a machine any time. Then, again, what's your friend apart from movement? Machine, you might be brave, you know, especially or a Obia, like on your Basavasa or Boom, and your Basavasa, Timmy Swimmy and Washington. And your team won today. How do you plan to party? How do you plan to? In, in this confinement, it's very <laughs> hard to celebrate, but all the same, we have our way of celebrating. We have fun together with our blog. I think the fun that we got onto the pitch, we are taking it onto the blog, and I think everybody will feel happy. It's a bragging right for us. We brag when we meet fellow blogs, we let them know we are the champions of the year. So I think it's a good opportunity for us. The Prison's Champion of Champions Cup is a season finale to the league organized by the service every year. It involves the two top teams in the league who battle it out for pride. Ni Ama Ashite is the Chief Superintendent of Prisons and explains the rationale behind the initiative. This is to bring the whole house together. You know, football is the heartbeat of the nation. And as such, we are not any different from the nation. So we do this to bring the house together as one family, to have fun, enjoy ourselves, and then show our talent, our god given talent. It's not easy at all, because uh, you know, the, the, it's not about the human quality. It's about materials, jerseys, boots, sometimes injuries, medication, medicals, and all sorts of things. It, it takes a lot, uh, a lot of money to put these things together, as you see. Football is, is a big issue in this, uh, in this facility. Um, not just about the image, but with the officers too. When they are happy and and they don't think bad. We are also free. We can go about our other duties apart from what we do. And this is one thing that brings them together, put the image and the houses, and then we share, we, through this, we share ideas. Once we come, people come with their problems. We know, we know them, we get to know them, they get to know us. So it's a way of in, interaction for us um, officers as well, as well as the inmates. Throughout the year, we have um, teams coming from outside to play our, we call it our, our local team, the prison 11. We need to get closer to the inmates so that whatever problems they have, we can share with them. And this is one easy means that we come closer to them and share ideas. Only three days ago, after a similar game, an inmate came to me, he's about to discharge, and he was telling me the circumstances that brought him to the prison. Well, that is the side of the story. It was very sad. Just before he finished, another person came with similar issue. So through these games, we avail ourselves as officers. They cannot come to our offices. We meet on the field, we chat, and then we invite them, and then we continue from there. So it's very important for us as an institution. You know, um, when you look at our numbers as officers and the numbers at, as inmates, we need to put things together so that we can see ourselves as one people. 
The only difference is that we wear uniform, but we, we try as much as possible to let them see us as, as we see them, brothers. We live together, we do everything together, and these are some of the means we bring them together. Interestingly, some, I think, six, seven years back, we were even playing a local league here, and we were playing our home and away here. I was told I didn't come to meet. But unfortunately, it has been thrown overboard. But aside that, the teams that come from outside, they come and pick individual talents. Okay, so when are you discharging? How, how can we assist you as you are here? And through that, they assist them. And as they go out, we link them with the teams and they go and continue with the game. They, are, they, they enjoy playing. It's, it's, it's also helping us. Football remains a very strong universal language and this is evident in what it is doing in the lives of these inmates here. More than reformation, it is helping to get dreams back on track, dreams that were shattered midway. But the chase is still on for many here. Sports Unlimited. Brought to you by Casapreco Alomu Bites.